I joined St. Neomine in 2011, November, as an environmental officer. From 2011, when we got into production, I would say I'm one of the people who have grown so fast in my career. In 2014, I was appointed as acting manager for the environmental department. And then I picked it up from that time to date as the head of the department. So I've seen St. Neomine grow from a team of about 14 senior staff employees, the majority being geologists, to to date when we are about 5,000 people. My guiding philosophy, or I would call it values in life, is that what you work hard for in life has the greatest value. And because you put in a lot of effort to achieve it, you are going to ensure that you protect it. And it's those things that we work hard for that are sustainable and they live on. In terms of uh, environmental management, one thing that I would say has worked very well for Sentinel Mine is that when a go-ahead was given to move from the prospecting period to the construction phase, planning of the project involved environmental management issues. So at the time we had the project concept, which was availed to the environmental team. And there was input from the environmental team in terms of what should be done right to prevent environmental pollution. And to also ensure that we plan for the end of mine life. So in 2011, we started planning for certain activities that we knew would definitely come when we get into construction as well as operation. And there are certain things that we did prior to project commencement that are going to reduce the end of mine liability. For example, stockpiling of topsoil. It's a valuable resource in rehabilitation activities. And so it was part of the planning phase and it was included in the project implementation activities where we had designated sites to stockpile the topsoil for use during rehabilitation activities. And the other thing that we did was to start gathering different types of seeds from the local environment that we knew these are seeds that we can use to promote our revegetation and site restoration activities. So the concept of the Sentinel project was so done in a holistic way that some of the things, the results that we are able to see now, they were not planned yesterday, no, but they were part of the initial project concept. If you go to our processing plant, we've planted trees there that are growing. The site is green and it's something that you never see at most of the mines. Sentinel Mine has a composition of employees who fully understand the importance of good housekeeping and they know it. And so we are at a point where every team member understands that when they are working on something, Part of their routine is to ensure that they do housekeeping at the end of what they are doing. We have managed to put together a team that is enthusiastic, a team that has a passion for environmental management, and a team that is self-driven. And all the achievements that you see around our mine site, it's a collective responsibility and our team as environmental department 
has done a tremendous job to achieve those things.